I am James Russell. I am a fifth generation family farmer from Rutherglen, Victoria. We have been producing grains for almost 100 years now, as well as producing uh, prime lambs for almost 50 years now. And our clover production has been something that has incorporated itself into the business over the last 20 years. A pest or disease can have a major effect on our farm. It can essentially wipe out entire crops overnight. And we need to be very conscious of that, which is why our biosecurity measures need to be in place to make sure we are protecting ourselves from those particular pests and diseases. We have lots of livestock and machinery moving between paddocks, and we need to make sure that we are doing everything we can to control the weed bank on one paddock and not spreading it to another paddock. Our livestock need to be managed and we need to use pathways that we know are clean and we know that livestock will not be able to pick up and move any weed seeds, insects or diseases that may hurt the paddocks they are moving into. Pests that we worry about will be insects that include aphids, uh, the red-legged earth mite and other small insects that can eat the uh, photosynthetic area of the plant. A biosecurity risk can affect not only us, our families, our economy and our entire country. We need to make sure that we are doing everything to help protect that, not only at our borders but also at our farm gates. We can monitor it, we can gauge it and we can make sure that no harmful pest diseases or weeds will enter this farm. In a way, it's like farming for today so we can farm for tomorrow.